Okay, some pretty big news coming up with Nice. He has just made a new account, something he has talked about for a while now. And um, yeah, I'm just going to go over what he said in his recent stream, um, how his account's going so far, and um, just what I, th what I think the future of Nice is. Um, and spoiler alert, I don't think it's good. Um, he he's still coping and he's still performing pretty bad. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. Okay, and the first thing I want to get into is um, his account. So, he only has, uh, how many games is that? Seven games total. And he has 100% win rate on his account so far. I mean, it's not ranked yet, so it doesn't even mean that much, right? This will affect his MMR, actually, later on, when he can play ranked. Uh, things like, I think your KDA does, I know your win rate does, um, all of that. And something I really wanted to highlight here is his KDA is 4.6 slash 5.4. Now, I've never leveled up an account in Korea before, right? I've never even played in Korea. But when I leveled up an account in NA, like, I averaged, like, easily double-digit deaths, right? And, like, very... You should just be, like, dominating, right? It, you're against the noobs, okay? Hey, that's just how it is, right? I've done, I've done this multiple times before. Um, especially considering that there's new rune changes. Um, I would expect for it to be even better for someone like Nice if you're... Because before I had to used to play against people that had actual good runes without having good runes. But I would still go, like, you know, 20 kills or whatever when leveling up an account. And I think that's how it is for most people, because you're, you're, you're smurfing on them even if you're not that good, because you're just playing against, like, new players or, like, silver players who are creating a new account for the most part. And really, the average tier is, like, bronze for um, new guffle games. But he is averaging this KDA. That's disgusting. Like, look at this. He's playing fewer top. He's literally only played fewer top. 47% dual win rate. Okay? That's disgusting. 47% dual win rate. Farming. He's losing lane on average. This is literally just disgusting. How are you losing lane on a champion, like, so powerful early game, um, and who is so just OP and dueling, um, when you play her, and you've played her a lot, Yunis has played hundreds of games of Fiora recently, and you're up against, like, bronze players. It doesn't make any sense to me. Like, this is already, and again, I'm not, I'm not saying it's necessarily tryharding, but this is already proof that Nice is, like, mechanically washed very, very much, okay? Um... Like, th this should truly be embarrassing, okay? In my opinion, this is embarrassing. Um, it, it doesn't mean much, right? Like, it's not as embarrassing as him being stuck in Platinum for, like, years, but it is it is still embarrassing, okay? I, I mean, that's just the truth to it. L like, you're, you're not against good players, Ys. You're You can't say that these players are good. <laughs> these are iron players you're playing against, essentially. Like, these players would be, like, iron NA, too. Um, and you're losing to them. And, like, for example, this is someone that, um, Nice went, he lets Laner go 8-4, and, uh, he won the game because he got carried, but this is a 44% win rate with a negative KDA and, you know, piss slow, and they don't main top either. Like, Nice, how, how embarrassing is that, okay? How embarrassing is that? Like, I literally don't know any way to say it, but that's just embarrassing. He doesn't even have died to gangster. That means he wasn't even ganked much. And he still has his dual turn rate. That's literally embarrassing, okay? Like, I, I know I've said this a lot, but that's embarrassing. For you to not be camped by jungle and lose that hard to literally an iron player who doesn't even play top, that's like career ending almost, okay? I, I really just wanted to emphasize this because I thought it was hilarious. Um, I mean, truly, truly, it, it, it is career ending. Like, <laughs> like, how do you lose that bad to someone who doesn't play this game? You're down CS, down... Uh, KP, down everything, uh, more deaths, and this is a champion you play a lot, like, a lot, a lot, okay? There's just no excuses for something like this, um, Fiora versus Aoi matchup, I don't even think it'll be that bad for, for Fiora, right? Like, Aoi counters tanks, like, Fiora, I think, could do decent against Aoi, at least, I don't know. I mean, I don't play either of them particularly, but, I, I mean, like, look at this damage graph, okay, guys? This is just, um... Yeah, 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 I'll just leave it at that, um, but yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go into some of, um, the reasoning behind why Nice has, uh, made a new account. Okay, so Nice has been coping a lot, and here he is pulling up graphs and stuff, saying that him being Diamond in, uh, Korea is, like, so good, right? It, it, it's not, but, or not even being Diamond, him being Platinum, he's, like, top 3%, because this is for Korean, he's, pro he's proving that, like, high elo, like, Masters Plus, is smaller percent in Korea, and that's actually something true, I didn't really even know about this that much, but apparently, like, Masters Plus in Korea is, like, half as much percentage as it is NA, so getting a Masters Plus in Korea is actually harder, because there's a smaller percentage of people there, of people in Masters there, I didn't know that, um, I don't know why that is, but that's, that's just how it is, 
But um, it's, it's not really that like that for like lower ELO, right? For lower ELO, it's going to be a lot more close to the actual truth. In fact, it's going to be actually be more people in lower ELO if there's less people in higher ELO, because that's just how math works. You know, it all adds up to 100% in the end. But Nisi is using this to excuse why he was in like somewhere between the around the top 4%, um, and claiming that he should have been in the top point like 5%, which is like the 0.5% is always mastered. It's like, I mean, it's mastered for any like. Point, if you're below 0.5%, like 0.6% uh, top players, you're, you're in diamond. But 0.5% is about where some regions get into Masters. Nice was at top 4%, about one-tenth of what Masters is for most servers. And I think percent is a better way to calculate like how good you are than um, like what rank you are. Um, uh, and in Korea, it, it's going to be harder to hit Masters because it is a smaller percentage. That, that is true. But 4% is not, like, equivalent to even NA.5% or EU.5%, and, um, yeah, this is nice coping. He also insults high ELO players in NA and EU West, saying that they don't know what they're doing, and it's completely different. Um, Nice, you haven't even played in high ELO Korea. Like, what are you talking about? Like, Nice is like, oh, it's not even comparable to Korea. Like, Nice, when you're, when your people are playing in Challenger NA, people are playing in Challenger EU West, it is a lot better than Platinum Korea. Like, I'm sorry, that's just the way it is. You're playing against Platinum Gold players in Korea. These are people who play the game casually, what, like, once every every other week sometimes even, right? And then you get really mad at them because they don't know what they're doing. Like, that's just how it's going to be, unfortunately, Um, when you're at the ELO. Sure, when you get to Masters, maybe there's uh, most people will be, like, no-lifing it, playing the game a lot because it's Korea and they, they, they care a lot about the game culturally. But in your ELO, that's just not how it is. So let's hear what Nice says um about uh, other, other regions to uh, high ELO players. I have studied and put work in on watching like high elo, uh, you know, high elo EU West, high elo NA. And I just, every time I pulled those VODs up, I was like, this is not the same. Um, you know, the players are, are demonstrably worse. All right. And so th I think um, he might be partially referring to, obviously um, he watched like Argurin or um, he, well, he watched like the, he's the rank one challenger, you know, jungler EU West. He has a video of it. And he pretty much just like questions his plays the whole time, and it's like, why are you doing this? Um, and he watches Devod, even though obviously he knows what he's doing way more than Nice, because he's like one of the best junglers in the entire world, maybe like probably like almost top ten junglers entire world uh, for solo queue. And and Nice like he he's not willing to accept that, and he just insults the people. And now he is again insulting high elo people. And as you can see here, here he is with like this graph. He's really just coping. And that's what I wanted to point out. Like, I just, I just wanted to point out for this video, him coping and um, how poorly he is performing. Like, again, this is literally like an iron level player. Like, not iron, but like silver, bronze. This guy's negative one rate in silver with a very bad KDA. Doesn't even play top very much. Like, how does Nice lose to this person? It's, it's astounding to me. Okay, like, let me know whether you think that this is a good omen, a bad omen for Nice. Uh, this is his new account here. Um, yeah, I think he uh, he's gonna be hand leveling it. I don't think you can like buy accounts or whatever if you're a big streamer, so you have to hand level it. I assume he bought like XP boosts and whatever. So he'll probably be playing ranked on it in like a week or two, depending on how fast he actually tries to level it up. But I am looking forward to seeing Nice. I want to see if he'll actually be able to climb. I want to see what champions he's gonna be playing. Um, I I think Fiora might be who he's playing. I mean, he's been playing Fiora already right here, but it's not been working out too well for him, even if he's 100% win rate on it, because. <laughs> Look at his KDA. He's losing to players who are disgustingly bad at this game, okay? Like, look, this set has only won against... Uh, or it's, Well, he didn't win against Nice, I guess. But, like, this set, like, he, he's, he's not won very many games, okay? Like, he's not playing against good players. These are literally iron players. Like, most people who even are in Diamond could go, like, 20 kills in these games, you would expect. Um, and obviously, I guess I'm saying from uh, NA, and I, I can't really apply this to Korea, but that's just how it is usually, and I can't really think it would be that much different in Korea. Um, but yeah, let me know about what you think. Like, it's kind of disgusting in my opinion what Nice is doing um, here, and he has like weaseled his way into making a new account when he said he wouldn't do it. Um, yeah, yeah, I just want to hear all your thoughts. Um, yeah. <laughs>